Hey guys, it's Ganfafenshi for all your Mac OS X needs. Hey guys, so um, I told you I'd show you how to get um get custom icons. So um, here it is. As you can see, I've changed my Finder icon and everything. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna have the link in the description. And you type in the letters, whatever they'll be. Download the file. I already downloaded it, so I download it again. Once you've downloaded the file, um, where do I put it? Download. I'll just search can do. So um, you're gonna get a file. Uh, that one. Well, yeah, you're gonna get a file like this, and you're gonna have a zip file. And um, if you open that zip file, um, you're gonna have this in it. And you're gonna have com.panic.candybar3.plisd. Now, don't open Candybar yet, okay? So what you have to do to get this for free is make them think that you already paid for Candybar. It'll have README text, and I have to go to Library and Preferences. So open New Finder window, and um, don't get off your name, okay? It has to be in your name. And you go to preference. Um, do I have to go again? <laughs> library. So go to library. Then go to preferences. And then um. Wait a second. And then you drag this into here, which I've already done. So I'll just yeah. And then it'll ask you to replace it, so just click replace. Then you have it for free. And then you can open um Candy Bar if you want. Now um how do um get icons? Well um open Safari, go to interfacelift.com. I'm gonna have the link in the description. And um you can download whatever ones you want. So I've downloaded downloaded like all of the ones on the first page and some as well, they look good to me, and um, I have them all in my icons right here. See that all of them, and then I have some more here, and then um, I put them all into here. So what you do is you um, you um, go to the icons, and you drag them inside there. So um, say I want to just drag desktop into here, I just drag it in there. And here it is. I'll just delete like that. So um, how do you change icons? Well, say I want to change my iTunes icon. It's not going to be in my Finder icons. Finder icons. It's going to be my applications. So I'll click on applications and let it find your applications. So just wait a second. And then um, search for iTunes. Here's iTunes. You can just change it. So I'll drag and change it. Then I'll just apply the icons. Type in your password. And then relaunch the dock. Just wait a second. And here it is. It's changed. So if I want to change it back, I find the other icon, which is this one. So I just drag it on. Apply icons. We don't stock. See, once you enter your password, it'll ask you again until like 10 minutes or something. And here it is, guys. So, guys, it's really cool with the custom docs as well. So, I totally recommend this. So, yeah, see you guys later.